Hey everyone, this is Dr. Lowell Salan together with Greg, Song, and Rishab are submitting Pixiland as our entry for this hackathon. The play-to-earn gaming in the Web3 space lacks cross-functionality. Moreover, gamers like to trade, buy, and sell assets. There's also lack of fungibility. There's no incentive for developers and players. And more importantly, there's currently no cross-chain marketplace for dynamic digital assets. This is where Pixiland comes in. Pixiland empowers gamers with a metaversal play-to-earn game using dynamic digital assets with the cross-chain marketplace. In terms of our market size, the total market cap for GameFi has climbed to about $55.3 billion as of February 2022. It is also estimated to grow to about $50 billion by 2025. And now for our product presentation. And now for our product presentation, I just want to mention that we are actually live at www.pixiland.netlify.app. Welcome to Pixiland, where we can explore, trade, and play to earn cross-chain dynamic digital assets. And I just want to bring you here to the navigation bar. So this is home. This is the bridge. Unfortunately, the bridge is not working right now. And this is, of course, the marketplace. And once you click, of course, you cannot see it yet because we are not yet connected. And again, I want to emphasize that whenever you connect to your wallet, make sure you are at the Mumbai testnet and that you can get, of course, some Matic from the Matic faucet. So let's do that now. Let's connect with the MetaMask wallet. So, okay, right now I want to connect with my name, Lowell. So let's do that. Let's click. And now once connected, you can actually see all the different pixies um, right now we can view them and i just want to again talk about vrf so vrf is actually used here to randomize the pixie name and then ipfs is used to store the pixie metadata so for example if i want to buy this pixie i'm just going to click this one and confirm then i go to my game and then i can see of course uh the different pixies here so let's just see uh, Lumine, for example, I select this pixie. Once I click uh, select this pixie, I will automatically be sent to this metaversal world where you can see there's a lot of pixies everywhere. So let's just roam around. Let's just see, for example, what the metaversal world looks like, what pixie land looks like. So very cool. You can see all the other fairies or other pixies out there who are actually also flying. And then later on, we could, of course, add castles or other images in this pixie land. So the sky is really the limit. Note that if you look closer here, you can see this picture frames. Let's go closer to those picture frames. So these picture frames are actually AI generated. They make use of what we call stable diffusion, which is the byproduct of DALI, another generative adversarial network project. And then once we enter, of course, let's go there. Let's click one of these frames. And then, of course, it's going to send you to this very beautiful, very interesting game. So the pixie here can actually shoot light beams. So these are all the light beams. Then, of course, later we could add balls here where the, the fairy can actually, uh, what they call this, hit. Now, if you want to learn more, follow our project, DME. And of course, before we end, I just want to thank everyone, especially the organizers of this hackathon, the Chainlink people, and also my incredible teammates, Greg, Song, and Risha, for making this possible. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm.